Hey what's up guys welcome to find gap and in today's video I'm going to teach you how you can add a CDN link in your react.js web application so without any delay let's start so first of all let's move towards the browser so we can get a CDN link from the internet so I will search here font awesome CDN and then you can open this first website so let's suppose if I copy this link tag from here then you need to open your code and open your public folder inside this you will see an index.html just open this let me zoom out a little bit so you can see that we have similar to HTML structure here and we can paste our CDN link here let me comment here my font awesome CDN link so now it means I can use font awesome icons in my react.js application to test this either font awesome icons are working in our application or not we need to open the browser and here i will search for font awesome icons you can see the first website you have to open this and here let's suppose let me search here globe so we have different icons for globe let me choose this free one so i will select this and from here html i will click on this to copy this HTML and now I will open my code editor then let me close this public folder and I'm also going to close this HTML file and if you see inside our source folder we have an app.js which is our you can say main component from here let me remove this my old component and here I'm going to paste this HTML now we will run our application to run this I will click on these three dots and terminal and click on new terminal here I will run my command npm start okay friends so you can see that our application is running and here if you can focus we have the globe icon in our react.js application so friends this was the process that how we can add any CDN link in our react.js application you can add any CDN link maybe when you use Google font you need to add that CDN and there are many much more cases in which we require to add CDN in our website so this is the way that how you can do this if you have any question you can ask us in the comment section we will try to answer your question and please subscribe to our youtube channel for our regular videos and finally thanks for watching